Hey, good evening, everybody. First of all, a huge round of applause to all the entrepreneurs here and in the room. I think uh, this is the power that makes Bangalore, Bangalore. So uh, delighted to see a full house staying on till the evening. A uh, couple of things that I just wanted to share. One is uh, Thai Global Summit, which, which you just saw the video, is coming to Bangalore, most likely in the middle of December 2024. Uh, in our minds, it's just not an event, but it is. it has to be an orbit shifting uh, event that will really change entrepreneurship for the better. Right? Can we, can we leave a mark, not just on our city, our state, our country, but can we really make a mark globally? Right? Um, and in our mind, it's just not one event. We're going to have a series of events. Uh, we're planning maybe five, ten global events in the run-up, not just in Bangalore, but we do it in Mysore, hopefully uh, Bangalore will be. So it is a community event, right? It is not just Thai, which is organizing it, it's all of us, it's our city, and we'll have lots of fun doing it. Right? So my ask <coughs> to all of you is we will need as many people as possible to participate. It has to be a movement, it's not an event. Uh, so I need each and every one of you to put up your hands and say, hey, here's what I can do. And let me know what you want me to do and we will absorb everybody in. Right? You want to host. Uh, and obviously at this, the spotlight will be on women entrepreneurship. You're all aware that we run the Thai Women uh, Entrepreneurs Program globally. So the finals of it will happen most likely at the TGS uh, Bangalore. So there will be a lot of women entrepreneurs from across the globe cheering. The other part is to bring a lot, lot of young entrepreneurs. It's lovely to see a lot of young entrepreneurs in this room as well. And that's the power that we want to say that, listen, uh, what can we do to create a, a, a much better environment for youth, women, and entrepreneurs of all sorts. So it's, again, the third angle is this is not a tech event. This is an entrepreneurship event, right? So, of course, tech infuses everything, but we want to kind of bring in the whole MSME ecosystem. We want to bring in educationists. We want to bring in healthcare professionals, right? And make it really a celebration of entrepreneurship rather than just tech, right? And, uh, uh, you know, in this journey, we will have the governments with us, uh, fortunate to have the support of Karnataka Digital Economy Mission. The state government is very much a part of this. All chapters in Karnataka are part of it, and our friends like Ram, uh, and, and 60 other chapters from across the world. It is a Thai global event being hosted in Bangalore. So it's really a Thai global rather than a Bangalore event. So look forward to all of your uh, support, ideas, uh, spreading the word, everything that uh, goes along with it. Uh, that, uh, and, and it's your event, it's our event. So let's make the best of it. Uh, really want to kind of... Uh, uh, you know, Bangalore being what it is in Karnataka, we want to make it like the celebration of, of the city, right? So we want to go out all stops to make it really like Christmas will come early to Bangalore next year, right? Vanita is already in the mood. Absolutely. Right? Totally. Uh, the other thing that I want to share is that this will require an army to execute on a full-time basis. Most likely in a couple of days, we're going to launch what we call as a TGS fellow program. So we're offering a one-year fellowship uh, for people to come and spend time with us, uh, which would be ideally full-time, maybe part-time, uh, ideally pro bono or low bono, right? uh, to spend a year with us. And the experience of doing it will be crazy, right? We just got off a tech meeting where we're saying, how do you involve 10,000 MSMEs in the city uh, to engage with us? Right? How do you, uh, the, the, uh, the goal that we have is, can we listen to the Elon Musk and the Sundar Pichai's of the world? Right? Can we get inspired by people like that? So the dreams are audacious. Uh, we'll see what it translates into execution. We are still in the dreaming phase. Right? We'll get to the constraints later, budget, people, resources, venue, traffic. All that will come later, but right now we are in the dreaming phase. So any one of you interested? In, you have to keep dreaming, yeah? Exactly. Right. So, any one of you interested or if you have friends who are willing to become TGS fellows, we're looking for about 35, 40 of them. Uh, anybody interested, please, Ritu is the person to talk to. And uh, fun guaranteed, <laughs> networks guaranteed, 
I began my Thai journey just as a point. My engagement with Thai began in 2007 when I was a volunteer and we used to organize Thaikon in Bangalore then. And my highlight was being uh, given the, the, the opportunity to chaperone Mr. Azim Tenji, who was a keynote speaker. And I still remember that one hour I spent with him receiving him at the entrance to Pradit Ashok and then spending an hour taking him on to the stage, of course. You know, you were just making sure that the water was there, coffee was there, but being in just the presence of that great man changed my life in a lot of ways. Uh, so I invite all of you to be a part of this, maybe have some life-changing moments, and as I said, 100% fun guarantee. Uh, whatever happens, we want to have fun. So do join the camp. Right. Thank you so much. Uh, please round of applause to the entire time, security team that will do the uh, Fantastic day. Delighted to see the whole Hampton Park station by all of you. Uh, have a great uh, day, a great year ahead. Thank you. Thank you.